if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe my channel do like the videos drop a comment and share it with your friends let's get started hi kids welcome to the channel simplified learning with dimple malik we are studying class 8 comparing quantities and the subtopic is percentage and its application so in the previous video we had done various types where we were supposed to convert the percentages into fractions decimals find a quantity etc so today our first topic is to find one quantity as percentage of the other quantity so for example if i say express 30 centimeter as percentage of 2 meter and 40 centimeters so now what I have to do is simply my I have to solve this and it is going to be the formula is required percentage required quantity upon the original quantity into 100 so my required quantity is 30 centimeter so this will be 30 centimeter what is my original quantity my original quantity is 2 meters 40 centimeter so if I have to first convert it into centimeters so that I do have the same units in the fraction so 2 meters 40 centimeters can be written as 200 centimeters plus 40 centimeters this becomes 240 centimeters so 30 upon 240 centimeters into 100 for 2 12 5 2 6 15 3 2 3 5 so this becomes 25 by 2 percentage or 12 1 by 2 percent so this is how I express one quantity as the percentage of other quantity that is 30 centimeter is 12 by 1 25 by 2 percent of 2 meter 40 centimeters let's move on to the next topic next part is where we have to express percentages as ratios and then ratios as percentage so if you have to express 150 percent as ratio I am simply going to do 150 upon 100 and I'm going to simplify 5 threes are 5 twos are so the answer is 3 ratio 2 or if I have to express ratio as percentage I am simply going to do if I have example 2 ratio 5 and I have to convert it as a percentage so 2 by 5 in 200 this becomes 40 percent so very simple whenever we have to represent anything in the percentage form we divide it by 100 and if we have to represent anything as a percentage we multiply it by 100 sometimes we require to find the change of the percentage like how much change is there in the final value so simply we have a formula for percentage change which says the actual change that is either the increased value or decreased value upon the original quantity for percentage error we simply write the error upon actual value into 100 so these are our formulas let's put them in the questions and solve them my question is Rita's weight decreased from 80 kg to 60 kg find the percentage decreased so whenever I have to do the percent change I simply do the change upon 
original quantity into 100. So what is my change here? Her weight was 80 but it decreased to 60. So my change is going to be 80 minus 60. The change becomes 20 kilograms. Now how much will be the percent change? 20. What was the original quantity? What was her original weight? 80. It changed to 60. So 80 minus 60 is my change and original quantity is 80 kgs. So 80 into 100. Let's solve it. 2 4s are 2 5s are 4 1s are 4 5s are. So the answer is that her weight was a 25% decrease in the original weight. Let's move to example number 2 for better understanding. Another question is, the distance between the two places was 200 kilometers. It was measured as 280 kilometers. So there, initially the difference is 200 kilometers. But what did the person who was measuring the distance did? He committed an error and it became 280 kilometers. So now we have to find how much is the percentage error that was committed. So percentage error formula is error upon original quantity into 100. Children always write the formulas in your solutions. It makes sure that the teacher knows that you know the formula and if you have done some kind of calculation error it is something else and it is not that your concept is not clear. So always write the formulas. So this becomes now error is initially it was 280 minus 200 so the error is of 80 kilometers. So it is going to be 200 which was the originally value taken. So it becomes 80 upon 200 into 100. So I simply deduct it. This becomes 40%. So the error percent here is 40%. The third example is that cost of a train ticket from New Delhi to Dehradun has risen by 20% to rupees 600. Now here we have been given a 20% increased value which has risen to 1600. So we don't know what is the original value. So we have to find out the original value. So we are going to find it. So let the original price be rupees x so if the original price was rupees x the increased is 20 percent so let's find the increased price 20 percent of x has been increased so this becomes 20 upon 100 into x which gives us the value x by 5 now this is the increased value this is the original value increased how much is increased now after increasing what is the new value old value plus the increased amount so this becomes 6x by 5 so I have taken simply the LCM here and multiply here we when we keep, take a common denominator then the numerator is going to be checked out and if there is 1 here so 1 into 5 5x x so this becomes 6x plus 5 I hope this is simple LCM that I have taken that you all are already aware of now this becomes 6x plus 6x by 5 which is the new value according to the question the new value is rupees 600 let's read it once again the cost of train ticket from New Delhi to Dehradun has risen by 20% it has already risen and now the new price is rupees 600 to rupees 600 so this is the new increased price here we have the new increased price as 6x5 6x by 5 so what is it that my amount going to be 6x by 5 is equals to 600 because this is the new equation and this is the new amount value so if I simply find out the value of x 600 into 5 divided by 6 here so my x becomes 
rupees 500 so therefore the initial value was rupees 500 we increased 20 percent of it which was 100 rupees and then the new value came out to be 600 rupees so when i solved it back to my answer it became rupees 500 okay children this is it for this video if you are new to my channel and you haven't subscribed to it yet please go ahead and subscribe my channel don't forget to press the bell icon and also like comment and share with your friends